Hey guys, what's up? It's Amanda. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's vlog. Today we are just having a little, uh, I'll probably vlog today and tomorrow, do a little day in life. Um, it is Thursday. I don't work today, which is weird because I feel like I usually work like every single Thursday. So it feels like Friday, but it's not Friday, which is crazy. Um, but I am home all day today. It is a solid uh, 85 degrees outside right now. Um, I'm planning to go hang out with some uh, friends from work a little bit later this afternoon and we're having a little like fondue night too and then Alex is actually having some of his co-workers here so uh, a night full of co-worker hangs and then tomorrow one of my friends from high school who I haven't seen in like over six months probably maybe since before I was pregnant um, is coming and my like town i grew up in is having a we have like this yearly weekend celebration thing so that's what we're gonna do tomorrow um let's go there it's still gonna be hot um so good news is our air conditioning works um colder in some spots warmer in others um our basement is freezing um but yeah we also have some really freaking exciting house updates um number one we have our stools let's get a good angle of this we have our stools i will link these below they're from amazon they're like a little like grayish leather um they're super comfortable alex put them all together yesterday and he said it was not difficult at all so we ended up getting six of them so we got a pack of four and then a pack of two um but they're super comfortable and we're excited about it and then the other super exciting thing is uh, on Monday, I was at working at the daycare and I got a text from where we ordered our couch from, which uh, our couch originally was supposed to be delivered around end of August. <laughs> and then I got a text like a month ago saying that it was gonna be like mid to late July. And then I got a text on Monday saying, hey, we want to just confirm your address for delivery on Wednesday. So we have a couch in our basement. Um, I will go show you. So yeah, it got delivered yesterday. And then Alex and his dad and his sister were here uh, and helped us move it because I obviously can't really lift too much right now. So let's go take a look at the couch. I don't know if I even showed you the bed. Oh my gosh, you guys, there's so many updates. Okay, also we have a guest bed. This, we actually are getting a box spring and a frame from one of my coworkers, so that will be here soon, but throwback to our old comforter. It actually fits nicely in here, so works for me. Um, and then the most exciting part, we're getting an ottoman for it, so we don't have that up yet, but it's also not in position all the way. We're gonna back it up more, but you guys. We got it from Slumberland. Um, it was on sale at the time, so we got it for like $1,200, like that's it. Um, this is our old coffee table, obviously. We have a cat toy there. It came with like three pillows, which I feel like three is like a weird number of pillows, but whatever. Um, but anyway, it's like a three-piece sectional, so there's this piece. There's this piece and then there's that piece, but it is so comfortable. Now, well, we gotta break it in a little bit, but hi Miko, feels like a basement in here. So now we're gonna get another TV and then we're gonna have the same like square thing that we have upstairs for down here. Hi, do you like your couch? What do you think? You like it? So yeah, we, thought this was gonna come in July so we were not ready pre prepared to buy TV yet but I think we'll probably buy it this next weekend or the weekend after and then it'll we have an ottoman coming too so eventually when the ottoman comes we will get rid of this stuff but it's not quite as deep as I thought it was gonna be in my head but it's also like very <laughs> firm so I think it just needs to get like worn in a little bit, but. And I'm pretty sure that the cats cannot fit underneath it, which is the most exciting thing. Not that I don't love you, but I don't want you to go under there. That is the biggest 
update housewise um i am pregnant <laughs> and i don't know how my body feels about this heat so far um but the baby has been moving like crazy and i just finished editing our uh old wives tale video that will be up before this one um but yeah so let's go back upstairs um i also don't think i showed you this i might have talked about it but we have a crib maybe i did talk about it i don't honestly remember but i'm gonna see if alex will put this together with me tomorrow before he goes to work and i've already showed you a baby swing but we have a crib guys we have a crib also i feel like this outfit i'm wearing today i have not quite figured out how to wear these shorts if i should have them like down a little bit or if i should just keep them here i don't know i have not decided yet what to do but uh i'm definitely growing a baby in there i moved since the last time i chatted with you but i'm doing laundry and it's a done so i should move it to the dryer but i'm just sitting here hanging out with the babe we're very active this morning um this morning i was laying in bed and i like had my shirt pulled up and I literally saw my stomach move like that was the first time I'd seen it like, I feel it all the time and I can feel it from the outside but wild let's go finish laundry <laughs> It's about 11.45 now. I'm gonna eat something for lunch. I'm actually just gonna have some leftovers because it's easy enough. Um, and then I need to fold our laundry. I'm actually gonna fold Alex's stuff too because he's having some friends over after work and don't really wanna have laundry on the bed with him home. So let's do that. And then I need to put some sunscreen on because I'm gonna go outside. All right, we got some leftover cracked chicken for dinner. Miko knows it's almost time for her to eat lunch, but eat this real quick and fold some laundry. <laughs> Alright guys, I have applied my sunscreen. You can't really see it. Um, I'm gonna go hang out with some coworkers. I will chat with you guys probably when I get back in the morning. Not when I get back in the morning, but I'll probably chat with you guys in the morning and hopefully Alex will want to set up baby's crib with me because I really wanna do that tomorrow because I feel like it'd be so fun. Good morning, friends. Excuse the noise in the background. They are still working on landscaping. So it is Friday now. Um, yesterday I left you before I was going to my friend's house. I ended up going there, hanging out outside, um, and my allergies decided to kick in as I'm sitting outside. It literally was like one moment I was fine and the next moment I'm like congested. Super fun. Um, but anyway, today is Friday. Um, we already had breakfast. I'm drinking some coffee right now. Um, Alex is still here and we are gonna try to put together the crib. We don't have like a mattress or anything for it, but I think it'd be fun to just get it started. So that's what our next thing on the agenda is today. And then I have one of my friends coming over and we're gonna hang out and head to a little festival thing later this afternoon. So I'm basically here for moral support and holding things together because Alex is in charge.
right guys, we have a crib. We don't have a mattress yet, but we have a crib. It honestly was not too bad once we figured out how everything works, but it's from Target. I will link it below for you, but ooh, it makes it so real. All right guys, hey, we are in the bathroom now. I am gonna just kind of briefly get ready for the day. It's really hot out still, so I don't think I'm gonna do anything with my hair, but we'll, we'll see what I decide. But for now, I'm just gonna put it up in a clip because that is what is the easiest to do. But we'll see if I keep it this way. Um, so, my skin has been like real rough recently and I, I don't know why. I mean, I do know why. It's a combination of being pregnant and wearing masks. And I've never had great skin, so it's fine. But um, I do want to put a tiny bit of sunscreen on today because I know I'm going to be outside. And I am trying to not get sunburned. And then I've been having like a slightly different makeup routine when I'm like putting on like more of a full face. Um, so I start with this e.l.f primer like a power grip primer um which is like a little bit it's like low-key like sticky which is good because i feel like it makes everything stay on my face and then i have this this concealer from milani we just dab under our eyes and all over our acne spots it's not even like full acne it's just like scarring that i have now beauty blend that out i need to get another makeup spray again i used to use one all the time in college and i haven't been but i miss it i feel like it makes everything stay all right and then for um foundation i've been using this it's the l'oreal um like hyaluronic uh tinted serum so it's not as full coverage as like uh like a full foundation would be blend that out again then the rest of the stuff is the same butterfly stuff for my eyeshadow i'll put some powder on it in a minute but i like to let the foundation sit this powder is honestly probably expired at this point. Oops. Let me know when does when does powder actually expire because <sighs> who knows. Also, I like keep having these moments where I'm like, holy crap, I'm gonna be a mom. Like, I'm gonna be responsible for a whole other human. But then I get really excited because like I feel like being a mom has been like on my list of things to do <laughs> for my whole life. Like I've just always pushed myself having kids and it's crazy. I am officially 23 weeks today. So we are well over halfway there. Cause I'm not going to 46 weeks. I mean, see, <laughs> would not be good for me. Face makeup done. Good enough. The crazy thing is I have no idea what I'm going to wear today, but my friend is coming over in a little bit and she'll probably just help me because I'm at this, still this little kind of weird point where like certain things you can tell that I have a bump. Like what I was wearing yesterday, you could totally tell I had a bump. But like today, if I just stay like this, besides if I like poke it out a little bit or like I push my shirt there, you can't tell. But like we got a baby in there for sure. All right, guys, we have gotten dressed um i don't know for sure if this is what i'm gonna wear yet but whatever we have a dress on because it's easy and it works and you can kind of tell that i'm pregnant a little bit but i don't know i don't I feel like none of my clothes feel like they fit me right so that's always super fun and it's hot out, so I don't know what to wear. Like, if it was a little bit cooler, I would do jeans and a shirt, and that'd be easy, but I don't know what to wear. So we're going to go with this for now, and we'll see how I feel later. Also, I curled my hair, and I'm wearing contacts, not glasses. So. Hi, friends. <laughs> it is definitely Saturday now. Um, I'm slacking in the vlogging department this week. 
so far. Um, it is like 10.30 uh, yesterday. One of my friends from high school came over and then we hung out and went to my hometown and had fun. I don't know, <laughs> whatever. Um, but this morning we are going to pick up a bed frame and a, what's it called? Box spring um, for our guest room downstairs for one of my coworkers who's moving. And I work at three o'clock, so got a little few things we have to do before I go to work, but let's go grab some, a box spring and frame. All right guys, so <laughs> I, we, we got the mattress and stuff. I definitely have already gotten ready for work and stuff. Um, but I don't know if you can tell, I didn't realize that it was a full, <laughs> full size box spring and it's not a full size we have a queen size mattress so for now it's gonna be what it's gonna be it's fine i mean just kind of looks like it's floating a little bit um but for now it'll be fine <laughs> um i work until 11 30 tonight so that'll be super fun um, but I'm going to end the vlog here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any more videos from me. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.